Hello everyone, welcome to the DPB Podcast. I'm your host, Ryan Mondes with DisneyPinsBlog.com, the latest news on Disney pin trading and collecting from around the world. This is episode number 74 for the week of February 6th, 2017. Welcome to the Disney Pins Blog Podcast. Hey guys, welcome back to the podcast. I am back home after my short little trip to Walt Disney World. Had a great time when I was down there uh, checking out the uh, Epcot Festival of the Arts. Uh, if you guys are subscribed to the YouTube channel, there's lots of vlogs coming and uh, other exciting pin videos uh, coming up from Walt Disney World and uh, the Disney Store for their uh, special uh, weekly re releases. So be sure to keep an eye out for that. Uh, but yeah, I had a great time. Uh, Jen will probably be back on the podcast with me next week. Uh, so this week we'll just talk about like our regular pin news. And then uh, towards the end for Disney Pin Chat, just wanted to talk about some uh, up upcoming uh, pin events. Alright, let's get right into the news. First we're going to start off with Disneyland Paris. The uh, calendar came out for the uh, February 2017 pin releases. And uh, lots of great ones. There's uh, a couple coming out for, our, for uh, Beauty and the Beast. And also some unique Minnie Mouse pins. And uh, a New Little Mermaid Valentine's pin, which I know was uh, pretty popular when we posted it. Uh, so yeah, very nice pins there. And their next pin trading night is February 24th at uh, Disneyland Paris. Next, the uh, AMC Theaters just released images for the new... Beauty and the Beast live action film coming out because they're going to be having pin releases for it. There are three different pins that are being released. Uh, you have to be a Stubbs member, like always. Yeah, you just purchase the ticket and it's usually just for one weekend. Uh, it's going to be in March. Uh, and it's usually the first or second weekend they do it. And there's three different pins that are being released. They come in blind bags. One is usually rarer than the other. Uh, there's one featuring Belle, Beast, and then the Rose. Uh, so those are pretty cool. Definitely excited for that film to come out. Next, let's head over to Disney Store UK. They had a Valentine's Day uh, pin preview. Uh, this is going to be released on February 7th. It's a uh, limited edition pin. It's LE 400 in Europe and then limited edition of 700 worldwide. So that one should be coming to uh, Disney Store in America. Retail price is £9 in uh, UK and it features Mickey and Minnie sharing a kiss. Uh, the background has a heart and then the top of the pin says 2017. There was a new Pin Trader Delight flip at Disney Studio Store Hollywood this past week. Uh, it features Sebastian um, from The Little Mermaid, Dim from A Bug's Life, and a Crackle from Sophia the First. Uh, Sebastian is a limited edition of 400 and the other two are a limited edition of 300 and I'm uh, pretty sure Sebastian already sold out. I know that was a popular one. There also was a cast member exclusive pin release this past week featuring Lilo and Stitch. The 15th anniversary is an oval style pin and is limited edition of 500. All right, let's head over to Disney Parks. Uh, actually, when I was down in uh, Florida last week, I saw a new Baymax lanyard medal, which is uh, pretty cool. It's uh, you know features the white version of Baymax and. Uh, the metal on it is kind of like uh, bubbly. It almost looks like it's rubber, but it's not. It is full metal. Um, so yeah, that's a nice new lanyard accessory if you guys are fans of Baymax. And uh, retail price for that one I think was $14.99. And then also at Disney Parks, uh, we put up the weekly pin post a little late uh, just because we had to wait for Thursday for the pin releases to be announced uh, since Disney uh, isn't putting up the the monthly releases anymore. Uh, so yeah, last week there was two monorail mystery pin sets. One at Disneyland and one at Walt Disney World. Very cool mystery pin boxes. Those were limited edition as well. And then there was a new character connection pin set featuring Aladdin. Uh, there's eight puzzle pins, limited edition of 1100. And then there were two chaser pins that were limited edition of 600 each. And then also the next Star Wars pin of the month uh, pin was released and that one features Jakku and it is pin number 10 of 13 retail price is $15.99 and yeah that's all of the uh, new pin releases from last week 
uh, the, the February calendar still isn't out yet. I don't know if they are going to be posting or not, but uh, we will be sure to post them um, on Thursday as soon as we uh, um, get uh, images from uh, both coasts. Also this past weekend was week number two of the Disney Store 30th anniversary uh, pin collection. And uh, this one featured Beauty and the Beast, Aladdin, and The Nightmare Before Christmas. Extremely popular release. This was um, definitely more popular than uh, the first week. And I was actually able to uh, get a few sets and uh, I put a vlog up on the YouTube channel. Uh, so if you guys haven't uh, have watched that yet, be sure to check it out. Alright guys, one last thing before we get into the Disney Pin Chat segment. Uh, I want to talk about Star Wars Celebration in Orlando. Uh, Disney Pins Blog is actually uh, sponsoring uh, the event and we will be attending. Uh, they do have pin trading there, a pin trading program. They're releasing, I believe, 40 different Star Wars pins. Uh, so for those who have their tickets already, they actually released, um, are going to be releasing the first two pins that you can pre-order online for this collection. Uh, you, do have to do, you do have to have a ticket. Uh, we have a blog post about it, so be sure to check it out, and you can click the link through there uh, to purchase them. Uh, but the first set features uh, C-3PO and R2-D2, and those will be launching on February 10th, 2017. Alright guys, let's get into Disney Pin Chat. So for this week, I want to talk about upcoming pin events, because there are a lot going on right now. You guys can check them out at uh, if you go to DisneyPinsBlog.com. We do have an events tab, we keep that updated regularly with all the events across the world. Uh, so first, let's talk about Pin Trading Fun Day in Hong Kong. We had a blog post that went up that featured all of the pin releases uh, for the event. And there's lots of different ones. Uh, many Duffy Bear and Shelly Mae pins. Um, and really cool limited edition pin sets. The Pin Trading Fun Day takes place March 16th through the 17th, 2017 at the Pavilion at Hong Kong Disneyland Resort. Another pin event I want to mention is the new... A grand pin trading event at Disney Studio Store Hollywood. Uh, this one has a lot of amazing pin releases. It is uh, March 12th, 2017 from 1 p.m. to 6 p.m. at the Richard Nixon Library. There's two different packages. There's a ballroom package for $265, limited to 150 tickets, and then a trading package that's $150, limited to 150 tickets. And then there's, of course, different pin releases. There's a trading event pin, um, a Beauty and the Beast a marquee. There's a five-pin Beauty and the Beast set that is a limited edition of $300. Retail price is $140 for that one. Then there's these Princess Silhouette pins. They're all in gold. They're beautiful looking. They are a limited edition of $300 as well. Retail price is $123 for those. And then there's this new Mighty Tiny 4-pack collection for the new Beauty and the Beast live action film. And then there's a premiere collection featuring the stained glass enchanted rose, uh, limited edition of 150. And it's um, kind of similar to the one that was released at uh, the Destination D event, but this one actually has the glass over it and a couple of other roses on it. Uh, still a very, very nice pin. And uh, online reservations for that event begin on February 13th. 2017 at 9 a.m. Pacific uh, time, and that's um, the link will be on the Disney Studio Store Hollywood Facebook page to uh, register for that event. Another upcoming event is the Love is an Adventure. Uh, Disney still hasn't made any official announcement, but it is going to be August 25th uh, and 26th, 2017 at Epcot uh, in the World Showplace Convention Center. Uh, we'll be posting more information once we know. And then also, this really isn't an event, but uh, the annual pass holder, the AP Days, uh, is coming to Disneyland on February 10th uh, this week. And um, that is at Tomorrowland, Starcade. There will be pins, buttons, and lanyards that will be released. And that runs through March 9th, 2017. Uh, we'll be sure to post those pins once we get images of them. And then also, on February 11th, this is a non-Disney sponsored event, but there's the uh, uh, North Cal Pin Meet, February 11th, uh, from 4 a.m. to, or from, I'm sorry, 11 a.m. to 4 p.m. at the Round Table Pizza in Oakshade Town Center, located in Davis, California. 
And then a little later in the month, the uh, Mouse Pin Trading and Disney Pin Collector Society uh, Pin Trading event is February 25th, 2017 at the Holiday Inn uh, near Disney Springs at Walt Disney World Resort. So lots of great events coming up. Uh, and also, speaking of events, we're going to be having the uh, Epcot Flower and Garden Festival uh, coming up here. Uh, the opening date is March 1st. And uh, we should be seeing the previews of the pins for them, I would assume, either this week or next week. Uh, so yeah, keep an eye out for that. Lots of exciting things. So for the pin chat question this week in the forums, it is going to be, what is your favorite uh, pin trading event that you're most looking forward to in 2017? Uh, there's lots coming up. There's lots to be excited about. Uh, so go ahead and... Uh, Leave your uh, answer, and we'll be sure to uh, read it off on next week's podcast. All right, guys, I think that's going to do it for episode 74 of the DPB podcast. Yeah, I hope everyone has a great week. See ya.